So I'm going to get started on the, uh, the water supply system. I already pre-marked where I wanted all of my holes to be as far as where the misters are going. I got a 50 pack of misters off of Amazon. It was like eight bucks, so pretty cheap. Came with the drill bit to pre-drill the holes. I'm just going to put that into some half inch PVC. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and get these holes in, get these put into place, and then we're going to go outside and take a test run on it and see how these work out. Moment of truth. We are rolling. Yep, I think that's going to work just adequately. So all the way down, we have a nice field of view. Nice mist. It's actually getting my feet. Looks pretty good. I might put one more sprinkler head in over on this side, facing into this last hole. And uh, I think that should pretty much wrap that part out. Then all we have to do is take and uh, make the holes in the end caps for the supply line to go in, drill a hole down in the bottom for the drainage back into that bucket, and uh, we'll be good to go. All right, so I've got my big honking end cap for that six inch pipe, and uh, I've already selected where I'm gonna put the hole in. I'm gonna pre-drill that, and then I'm gonna use a butterfly bit to put it the rest of the way through. I'm hoping the butterfly bit will do the trick. If not, I did have my eye on something at Home Depot that would do the job, but I wanted to be cost effective, so we'll see if this works out. If not, back to the store. look on the inside I've got that flush mounted in there so the water comes in hits this low point which is the cap which is going to be on the the outside of the tube it's all going to drain down and through and then back into the bucket the system is up and running I just push that end cap onto place nothing's glued up except for this piece right here so you see some dripping here this isn't actually coming from inside here it's actually runoff since this is all sprayed out over the tops it's running down and then coming out the sides but uh, nice tight fit, worked out pretty well. Next step we'll have to do is to take and just push this other end cap into place and then affix the net pots into place and uh, start getting the plants in there.